This is Albert Ziegler with the Easy Business Network, and we have the Emergency Management Restoration is going to tell us uh, who he is and, and what he does. Hello, my name is Elvis, Elvis Cole. I'm the owner of Emergency Management Restoration. I cover all of Southwest Florida. I am your go-to person when you're dealing with a fire issue, a water issue, a mold issue, or a crisis issue. I'm your local go-to person to deal with any of these issues with the same level of professionalism as a large conglomerate company. We're local. Louder. We're local and we're here to serve you. This is Albert Ziegler with the Easy Easy Business Network and we're at the Black Expo at the Edison Mall and we have the new way to go telling you what they do and who they are. Hi, my name is Kevin Palmer, uh, owner of the New Way to Go. Uh, I sell uh, health oil and CBD products uh, here uh, at the Edison Mall for the Black Expo. Uh, as you see, we have our artist displayed here, located at the Edison Mall. Uh, it's a great opportunity. I'm very thankful to be a part of it. Hello, this is Albert Ziegler, the Easy Business Network, and we're at the Edison Mall for the Black Expo, and we have uh, some vendors here that are gonna tell you who they are and what they do. This is Pepper RC Jets, and this chair. She owns this business. We got lots of them today. We got plenty, $5 each, and some we got sets. We got green sets and some other sets. Paparazzi. This is the Easy Business Network. We're at the Edison Mall for the Black Expo. And this is a vendor. They're going to tell us who they are and what they do. Hello, this is Pamela Butler coming to tell you from Paparazzi, where everything is $5. The name of my business is all about that plane. Get your plane on for $5. $5. Check it out. No, I think. This is Albert Ziegler, the Easy Business Network. We're at the Edison Mall, and they're doing the Black Expo. And these are two vendors at the Expo. They're going to tell you who they are and what they do. All right. Well, this is my wife, Virginia. My name is Trevor. And this is the Meg, you know, authentic cuisine. And uh, we're doing today, we're doing mango barbecue chicken, we're doing jerk chicken, and uh, we're doing oxtail, rice and peas, you know, and uh, we definitely, you know, it's a pleasure to be here to participate and to really, you know, demonstrate authentic food onto people, and we're looking forward to see a lot of people come out and support us. Thank you, and uh, my wife might want to say something too. My husband forgot that we have more than just rice and peas. We also have cabbage and carrots. And we, just like you said, we're more than blessed to even be a part of the Black Expo. We've never done anything as far as this magnitude, but we're happy to be here. And we're visiting from Hilton Head, South Carolina. Hello, this is Albert Ziegler from the Easy Easy Business Network. We're at the Edison Mall, and we're here for the Black Expo, and we have uh, the vendors from the American Legion. They're gonna tell you who they are and what they do. This is Seth D. Bartolo. I'm the chaplain here at American Legion Post 38. And I'm Vanessa Metcalf, unit president for Unit 38 Auxiliary. And we're here today to show our support to the community as we continue to try and get supporters and uh, Legion members, as well as auxiliary members, try and say that ten times fast. Uh, as they, uh, we start to grow the new generation of Legionnaires here in Southwest Florida. So, if you are interested, and come on down. We are here at Post 38, as well as at the Edison Mall. The next couple of days, we do have membership sign-up forms. If you are interested as a member, as a veteran, a member of the Armed Forces, we'd love to have you. Thank you. Thank you very much for your time, and have a great day. Hello, it's the Easy Business Network. We're here at the Edison Mall for the Black Expo. And we have uh, 
Bobby here is going to tell us uh, who he is and, and what he does. Hey there, yeah, my name is Bobby Irwin. I'm originally from Kansas City, Missouri. I'm a retired police officer from Kansas City, Missouri. Been here, uh, I mean, five years in July. Uh, I am here at the expo to uh, sell, sell some of my books. I'm, a, I'm an author. Uh, my book came out in October. Failure to Comply is the name of the, of the book. It's an autobiography, all about myself, uh, some of the struggles I was having uh, growing up. Uh, lived in the inner city, uh, surrounded by all the drugs and uh, problems that, that that all brings. Uh, but I was also starting to get into trouble as well, and I had to I had to make a decision. Uh, I, I either was going to become a statistic or I need to find, find a new environment. So I decided uh, to join the military. I, didn't, I hadn't prepared myself properly uh, when I graduated. And uh, so I had to make a decision uh, that yeah, I, I gotta do something in my life. So I went to the military, went to the Marines, I did four years. That was an eye opener for me. I was able to see the world and uh, get to meet different people. Change, just changed my whole. I was just, I was just a totally changed person when I, uh, by the time I uh, got out of the Marines. Thank you. I decided to go back to Kansas City. Although when I left, I said I would never come back. But I did. And not only that, I became a police officer and patrolled seven years in the neighborhood that I grew up in. So uh, this book goes through all the challenges that that, that brings uh, because I was also. Uh, Getting calls to uh, break up fights at my parents' house, or friends, and it, it was uh, it, you know, the shootings, uh, people I knew, homicides, uh, chicks and people I knew. It was, it was crazy, but the book talks about all that and then some. And what I'm trying to trying to get people to uh, get out of the book is that uh, you know, even though you may uh, come from place where uh, real adversity, you know, just, just give just a little work and uh, try to focus on getting yourself out of that element. Uh, you can make something of yourself and, uh, and get back. I think that's really important. Get back. So, uh, the book you can find on, on Amazon, uh, website's www.failure2comply.com. U.S. and uh, appreciate all the support. Also, I don't know if you picked that up or not, but also uh, I'm working on the screenplay for this, and uh, I'm hoping by the end of this year we're going to have something on uh, Zoom or Netflix or who knows, even uh, a major motion picture. But I've got a lot of people excited about it, and uh, it's in the works. It's coming. Thank you. Yeah, yeah.